in a world where the dead mothers nursing their children and the fat redneck walking slash burping things stroll the lands. One, by the name of Vimo, stands up against it all. Through glitches and undetailed 13-year-old animation and production, he stands tall, taking down zombies and all that other undead and creepy stuff on Halloween. This is Vimo TV. Hey guys, so today I'm here. Oh, what are you look at that? What are we playing today? We're playing Killing Floor, and um, I'm out of fucking death flow. But for real though, today we're playing Killing Floor, and oh yes, that is how it's done now. You see that? You see that? Oh man. So I've I've played this game like a solid two times. Oh, oh, oh man. Way to get- OH! WHAT THE FUCK?! SHIT! 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 Not even phased, guys. So, anyway, so today we're playing Killing Floor, and I played this game solid two times. As I was saying before, I was rudely interrupted by some dead corpses. And... Oh, man, this game is so awesome. There's so many things that you can do in this game. It's absolutely ridiculous. I don't know what I just did. I think I... Did I just buy grenades? I... What the fuck? Anyway, so, oh yeah. Suspected cult. You know, you, I, mean, I mean, you know, you know you're living in a bad neighborhood when you, you got a suspected cult of dead people. I mean, check out that guy. He looks pretty sick to me. And then, oh, we got some missing children. Blood-soaked attack potato. Pat, pat, yo. Same thing. Savage attack on... <laughs> Absolutely savage that was. Wasn't it no regular attack? That was a savage attack. Watch when I turn around. I'm, jump I'm not digging you. All right, why am I missing every single shot? Hey, guess what? Sit down. Oh, you're already sitting. Why? Because you don't even have any legs. All right, you know what? You and your stupid little baby are so annoying. Stop screaming. Stop yelling! Nobody cares about you and your child! Oh, you think you're so cool, huh? You think you're so cool, you You see what happened? <laughs> you see what happened to you? Look at you. Is it, What is that? Oh, <laughs> nope, she's just, uh... She's going away for a little bit. So, you see, you see what happens there? <laughs> what do you have for me? See, I gotta go meet up with the Crips later. So anyway, uh, we're gonna pick up a nice one of those things. Oh, never mind. We got this now. So we have the diarrhea blaster. So we have the diarrhea blaster, and um, I like it. You got a belly button ring. Oh, you got a belly button ring. You really feel that's that important? You really feel that you re oh you're really obsessed with missing kids, aren't you? You really feel that that's so important that you have to have that. It's a zombie apocalypse, and instead of wearing armor or maybe something that's really gonna help you or maybe keep you warm and like in the weather, you're gonna wear that. You're gonna wear a belly button ring and a belly shirt. Is that gonna help you? Is that gonna help you? Yeah, you better close the door on me, cause you don't want to see where this conversation is gonna be bringing you. Oh. -ho -ho! Oh, oh, oh man! I oh I love the way that when you hit the uh, the mag release, the mag doesn't even come out for a good speed second. Takes a little bit there. You gotta think about whether or not they really want to take it out. Oh oh oh! Shoot you all down! Why? Because I can. I have an MP5. Hey, right now, just sitting here. Just oh, you're invisible. Why? Because well, you know. Fuck logic, right? Let's just let's just completely destroy everything. Because oh, look at me, look at me, look at me over here. Oh my god! That, <laughs> I don't know if anybody just heard that or not, but I can't even begin to explain to you whether or not that was English. What are you saying? Wow! Wow! Make a a Work a Look at, oh, look at this one. Look at, the, look at Chef Boy RD coming over here. 
This is Chef Boyardee's wife. What's up, girl? Oh, you better throw up on me. Oh, damn, your head, your hair looked like a bowl of mac and cheese. Oh, not the one you ate for dinner last night. Your boobies are saggier than your arm fat, and that is a damn shame. Yeah, yeah, yeah oh, look at that. The weight that you are, you still find the ability to balance yourself on this metal and walk across that little beam right there. And you know what? Being just, you know, the weight you are, so amazing how you can float and not even touch the ground. You know, I can tell the AI in this game are absolutely amazing. I mean... Nope. Nope. You know, you, you, you can really tell how much money was put into the AI and the characters in this game because if you really just take a moment... Okay, she... Oh, I love that little head bob glitch down the stairs. Alright, well, according to her, she's gonna get me somehow because I'm in this direction that she was walking. She's... She's leaving. Nope. Nope, she's coming back. Did a fantastic job. Fantastic job with the AI. I mean, seriously, just look at... Oh. Got a little, uh, little glitch up the stairs. Oh, you just dodge that easily. And is she holding a gavel? Is she a judge? Is she a judge? Oh, uh, the okay. The light behind her is now in front of her. That okay? That's uh, again the super, super job. Check this out. Oh, she still threw up on me. All right, guys. So I'm on my way to see Harriet Tubman in the Underground Railroad over here. And uh, we're going to see what weapons we can buy. See, more than anything, which is what's so amazing about this game, is you can purchase a potato, which has full range, full speed, and full power, and weighs absolutely nothing, and is only $70,000. Now, so amazing how they even make it go over the power line here, over the stats. Just, you know, if, that, I mean, like, if you ask me... That is just showing, it's, it's literally just screaming, wow, look at me. The, I am the reason that they poured a million dollars into this game. Alright, so this is working, this is working alright. I don't know why everybody doesn't just buy this gun and just use this. Because check this out, I can just completely burn you, because why not? And alright, you didn't even touch me, even though that's the guy that normally always kills me. Um, okay. I guess that uh, that works. I'm I'm totally okay with that. And then we got this thing here. What's this? Oh, beautiful! It's not overpowered or anything. This is not overpowered or anything. Yeah, you're not overpowered because I'm pretty sure every time I see a zombie, he's always oh okay, you're behind. Him. And then you have a pot. You know what makes the other guy so special that you walk around carrying a pan? Trying to hit me like you're some grandma or something like that. Dressed as a little redneck. And then we get this other guy who's absolutely huge, has really detailed nipples, and somehow has like a freaking firework launcher that can shoot me. Look at that thing. Not to mention it's his hand. Nope. Shooting rockets at me while other guys are carrying pans. I mean, yeah, that's something that happens in every zombie apocalypse. Why haven't they added that into The Walking Dead yet? Alright, obviously he's not dying, so let me just pull out my penis launcher and completely destroy him because this game can kill everybody! Oh, nope, gotta reload it. Gotta reload it. Oh, two seconds. There we go. Yeah, and look at that, he's dead within in, in an instant. In an instant. Yeah, not overpowered. So anybody that says that's overpowered, obviously you have problems. We are now carrying two 50 caliber handguns because you can definitely shoot a, hand, a 50 caliber using one hand dual wielded this is gonna be uh it's something everybody can do and then oh what's this i can oh i, I love how when i scroll down let's all right let's let's scroll down let's scroll up yeah that's uh that's that's nice the map is called this abusement park oh here us. we go <sighs> Alright, so we got Rick Grimes coming after us now. This is gonna be a fun time. 
Well, we got two 50 caliber handguns and a flamethrower. So, being as overpowered as everything is in this game, I can't imagine having a hard time. And again, look at that. The light through the through the post. That's that's amazing. Yep, and again with the overpowered. Look at that. One shot kill, no big deal. Watch this. Wow, that was a tough one. Oh, no, all right, you just decided to come out of. Okay, oh, all right, okay. He's uh, he just he just did his own thing. Okay, they're just going away. You just came here recently, so how how you doing? You missed a lot. Oh, he's back. Just gonna spam him with a few shots and uh, wait until he runs away again. Oh, then we got these bad boys who like to jump. Not really a fan of them. Oh, still overpowered as hell, even though it's a starting weapon that you can't even get rid of. And, uh, where's our little buddy? There he is. So we're just gonna finish off here. Love the slow motion of my animations, guys. It's awesome. Oh, he's coming. And, again, he has a hand. He's a rocket line. Oh, I, I just saw that come through the wall there. Wow! Look at that one! That was, uh... Yeah, that was a that was a big surprise. I didn't see that one coming or anything. <laughs> Absol absolutely amazing. Hey, what's up, guys? Vimo here. So anyway, I really hope you all enjoyed the video, and I just wanted to say happy Halloween to all you guys. So you know, go out, be safe, have fun. Who am I kidding? You guys are probably getting arrested. <laughs> anyway, guys, uh, I just want to say happy Halloween. Have a great time, and I really hope you enjoyed the video. So rate, comment, and subscribe. And as always, stay tuned for more episodes coming up in the future. I uh, just want to let you guys know that I will be making videos with a you, a new YouTuber who's a good friend of mine. His name is Valeriad. He'll be, you know, you'll see him in a couple of videos and stuff like that coming up. So just want to give you a heads up. Anyway, guys, once again, happy Halloween. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Peace out.